all right guys frukage here and welcome back to another video now this one will be a little bit different video so let me tell you just a little story uh so like uh, one week ago i went on a vacation uh, i decided to not to upload any video and not play any game just enjoy uh, have fun uh, we went to adriatic sea uh, it was so much fun so much fun and yeah we had we were swimming playing football playing volleyball hanging out with friends man so many awesome people and yeah pretty much like two days before i had in plan to go home uh the, the this okay, this happened this so pretty much i broke 80 percent of a hill tendon i believe it's called like that in english so pretty much it's the tendon uh that is right here okay i'll show you on another leg okay so pretty much i broke this tendon like 80 percent of it i was really lucky i didn't uh, broke like 100 percent because in that case this tendon that is connecting this muscle with the leg would go completely up it would be completely swollen and i would pretty much i would die of the pain uh, let me call it like that it would be so much more worse than it actually is so yeah before i start explaining everything i'll tell you i was actually lucky that my tendon didn't broke completely because then i would be in absolute 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 pain so let me now tell you what exactly happened so on thursday we decided to i decided to play one more day a little bit of football have fun with friends and then two days after that just having fun swimming relaxing and then going home with my car but yeah we were playing football uh it was like we were even winning which is not so much important because we did it for fun we needed to score like two more goals uh i scored like four my friends called scored a lot of goals we had we were just having so much fun and we were so freaking good and then on the field it's concrete okay it wasn't the grass it was concrete and there was one place when it had just a little bit hole in it and when i was going for the ball uh i was i was running and then just one wrong step into that hole and my freaking ahill tendon broke 80 percent the pain was like insane 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 i i, I won't forget it like never like never uh, i'll have an oper operation or surgery yeah more precisely surgery in about today is um yeah in about two days two three days yeah i'll have the surgery where they will uh, connect my tendon back together and the recovery will be for a long time okay uh, it will take me around one to two months until i can walk again like uh, until i can walk then it will take probably three months until i can drive a car and even half a year to a year so i can run again with that leg unfortunately that happens but i, I won't lose any motivation i'll keep on pushing I'll, I'll recover no matter what you never should give up even if it happens to you you should not give up here is my main tool that i'm using without this i can't go anywhere uh, I have my family, friends that help me out, but usually I want to do stuff by myself, okay? To prove myself that I can recover as fast as possible, okay? So pretty much uh, that day when that happened, uh, I was in so much pain. So David, Patrick, my cousins, my best friends, and everyone else that were there, they all helped me. They all carried me. It was like a long ride until the first hospital and then after that we needed to use the the ship so we can go to other island where there were uh, the hospital where they can see what exactly happened because at that moment we weren't sure it was the tendon is it the bone but yeah my friend david he was like 100 percent sure it was the tendon and he was like right and i even felt it it was like weird sound like a whip it was like a uh, disgusting sound when it broke uh, i was thinking that someone uh that someone hit me with the rock in my head in 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 my uh in right here i was thinking that someone uh dropped the rock so hard on my foot and i was like who dropped that who dropped that rock 
and then I saw no one was behind me, and then I, I, I even stepped on that leg, and it just, it just completely fall off. Like, you, you couldn't use that leg, it was just disgusting. So yeah, it, it was a freaking crazy ride. And then we managed after a lot of hours and I needed to hold my leg like this all the time. I didn't have yet uh, the, I don't know how to call it in English, but this white stuff all around me, gyp uh, gypsum. Yeah, I don't know how you precisely call it in English, sorry. But yeah, pretty much I, I needed to hold my uh, leg for like two, three hours until we arrived to the hospital. Then I needed to wait there for a few more hours and when I went to the doctor, he said what happened. They did the Thompson test and they were like 100% sure I need the surgery. They said I can wait for a few more days. So they, uh, they gave me uh, the Langetta, how, we, how this white thing all around the leg. So everything is immobilized. So I don't stretch my tendon even further. So for now, everything is good. I'm not in a lot of pain. So that's really good. I just wanted to say that I will make the videos, okay? This shit won't stop me, okay? We have the Ninja Tribes one and a half anniversary. There is so much stuff that I missed on My Hero Academia. I just need to go back on the track and everything will be fine. As I said, in two, uh, I'll have the surgery. Hopefully everything will be fine. The surgery is not complicated. Uh, I'm going to the private doctor. Because in regular way in Croatia, I would probably never walk again if I need to wait like a few months. So yeah, I'll need to pay. Family will help and everyone else. So that's really cool. Um, and yeah, after the surgery, there is just long, long recovery. But as I said, I, I fixed in my head that in one month, I'll be able to walk and maybe drive a car. That would be amazing. We're going to see how everything will go. Okay, I just wanted to tell you that little story. And just to tell you if ever if something like this ever happens to you do not give up okay keep on pushing everything will, will be fine as long as this is okay the head the brain everything else can be fixed okay guys so yeah uh i will do uh, i don't know i'm just now here with my laptop just like thinking what to do next maybe some ninja tribes videos since i saw some kcm naruto play any games for a few days so i'm a little bit you know behind but I'll do my best uh, to keep on pushing. But yeah, at the end of the day, everything went good. It could have been much, much worse. We had a luck. Uh, also, I need to thank the guy. Uh, I believe he was from the Germany when the accident happened. My friends carried me there. And the first thing that we saw was a man who was actually medically educated. educated. So he helped me a lot in that first moment with motivational speak and everything else. So I was able to push it through. And now I'm here sitting like this, not, not in a lot of pain. So I'm ready to go and to continue. Okay, before the surgery, after the surgery, and then we can recover in peace. Okay guys, I appreciate, well, hopefully this wasn't boring. Hopefully I was understandable. I'm a little bit still shaking, but uh, yeah. Everything is fine and I'll, I'll do my best to just just wanted to share with you guys because I really care that you know what the hell is happening with me and with the channel and everything else. As I said, the uploading will keep on going. Maybe today I'll just take one more break. Just, I don't know. And then after the surgery, I'll be good to go. Okay, guys. See ya and love ya a lot.